The Meilati campus of the University of Helsinki is the home of research carried out for a healthier world. Here, among hundreds of top medical researchers, the internationally renowned academy professor, Kari Alitalo, leads his laboratory and a team of top scientists. Alitalo is one of today's leading names in cancer research. Our vision and dream that in the future we can greatly improve the inhibition of blood vessel growth into cancerous tumors in humans, which results in better patient survival. Alitalo's laboratory is known worldwide for its pioneering research into the growth factors of blood and lymphatic vessels. The scientists have discovered several growth genes of lymphatic vessels. As a result of these discoveries, new types of cancer medications are being developed. So the uh, lymphatic vascular system is basically a drainage system. It's a, like a sewage system. We actually came across two genes which were receiving signals for blood vessel growth or lymphatic vessel growth. And then we realized that the lymphatic vascular system has not practically been studied. The, the former relevant experiments were done in, in the beginning of the past century. So this was a virgin area and immediately we realized uh, how many implications study of these vessels would have. Research into the lymphatic system is important from the perspective of many other diseases besides cancer. The new International Research Consortium, also led by Alitalo, studies the role of the lymphatic system in the development of obesity, cardiovascular diseases and type 2 diabetes. Uh, the technology that we have has implications in various fields of medicine. So we are in no way restricted with our technology to advance treatment modalities in a in vari variety of diseases. So we, we should not be thinking narrow. In addition to the very important role that lymphatic vessels play in cancer and metastasis, they may play a role in um, other chronic inflammatory diseases such as cardiovascular disease and obesity. We can also inhibit, say, two-thirds of the metastasis that occurs to the lymph nodes and on to the various organs. This would be a very significant advance in cancer treatment.